Yeah, of course we're happy. Um, any win is a win for us at this stage. Where we're at as a team growing and becoming competitive in Super Rugby. So it was important for us to finish this game properly. I think we learned from last week, um, you know, not closing it down at 23-22 maybe. And this week, even when the score came close, I, I felt we were still in control. So yeah, a lot of points left out there, but uh, it's early in the season. Um, we still have uh, the Christmas break to get rid of. So, and but there was some some good stuff, um, things that we've specifically worked on. Uh, the breakdowns, I think, was exceptional. So, um, yeah, definitely a step in the right direction. Clintons. No, I think it was while he was on the field, it was quite good. You know, so it's a pity. It looks like he's uh, injured some cartilage, rib cartilage. So, yeah, I think he's bit. He's gonna become better. He adapts well into our system. I mean. Um, it's a guy like Nick Lee last year just came in and stuck to the system and it worked well. So it's obviously great to have uh, 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 everything in place. And, and, and I think from his side, you know, he, he's contributing and he's he's giving his heart to the cheetahs as well. And and, and then he, then we can allow him one or two errors. So, but tonight I think he was, um, and especially the first 10, 15 minutes, he was really good. It's a pity that he got that knock. So yeah, but we'll assess and see how he looks going forward. Yeah, I know. Look, Ox is a good all-rounder. I think second half, especially first half, you can see he hasn't played for a bit, so he adapted well in the second half after um, we had a chat in, in, at halftime. Yeah, I think uh, he will also be assessed. He's had a bit of a MCL damage. We'll see if it, that's the same with Kasim and the same with, um, well, yeah, it's both of them. And then Renil Hugo obviously looks the most serious at this stage. Looks like he's kicked into the ground and injured his... Uh, his knee will have to have, have a look, obviously, see what. But then again, you know, from the start, we know injury is going to be part of it. So, yeah, we're going to just fight through it. Yeah, I think we handled the pressure better tonight. We shouldn't have, first of all, I didn't, I, I don't feel we should have um, come into the position where we were, where it was so tight. I think we were dominant the whole game. So, um, but after, you know, the switch on button came quickly when we, when the score came close and I think we learned from last week. Unfortunately, last year, the semi-final and the final was never tight, you know, so, um, so that meant, um, you know, we had to learn a little bit of a lesson last week, you know, being 22 up, 23, 22 up with uh, three minutes to go and I think we handled the pressure quite well tonight, so. Um, lessons learned going forward, you know, we are a team evolving and uh, so we'll just take that forward. Now look, we assess the players, oh, the, 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 the Bulls, um, you know, of what we know of them and what we've seen and obviously, you know, it's a total assessment. So, but I don't want to get too far ahead because we still got to play in that round. So, now look, it, of course, you know, the um, best character builder is winning, you know, team building is winning, you know, so that, uh, that helped. I lo I'm really appreciative of the way the guys did it though, so that was important. You know, they stuck to what we've been tra tra training, they work really hard at uh, the way we train. It's a big ask every week. We um, we put a lot of emphasis on the physical part in the last uh, two and a half months, so, you know, they uh, they under the pump most of the time so that we can continue, you know, being uh, competitive in collisions and contact situations going forward. So. You know, compliments, all compliments to, to the effort. I think win is important at this stage, you know, to, to give us a new enthusiasm going into the competition going forward. So um, I'm really appreciative uh, of that. I think the biggest thing would be uh, wet weather conditions, trying to get our exits more, more clinical sometimes. I think that's, that's going to be the hardest trick uh, going on tour, is going to be wet weather game plan. Yeah, no, we'll have to have a first have an assessment of what is the damage and then we'll have to look, you know, I don't want to fast track anybody. Um, it's unfair to the player coming in, not being 100%. It's unfair to the team, um, not uh, having a player at his best form there because we don't train or we don't um, come back to, uh, to play, we come back to perform. And that's very important, you know, the return to play is protocol also for Mike is going to be important. Next week, the, the, the other team, other part of the team will play against Griquas in a game, so that will obviously be an idle occasion to bring some of the guys back and put them on the, out on the field, um, if, if it's possible with the injuries that we've sustained. So, of course, we'll, we'll assess that all on Monday and all oh, this week, and then we'll see uh, 
how things develop. But it's true that you know Francho and and uh, even um, William is just around the corner and uh, Sean Fenter. And so Sergio's injury will will not be so, as long as we thought. You know. So yeah, like I say, it's going to be 54 players. Uh, involved in this competition and uh, hopefully everybody's prepared to bring their part when it's their turn. Yeah, I think I've said it from the start. I mean, we we want to be, we want to win. We, wa we wanted to win last year as well, but we were realistic, you know, so uh, we want to take it one game at a time and uh, make sure that, you know, we don't get ahead of ourselves or we realise, you know, that to win tonight took a really big effort and it's going to take a big effort every week until we We've matured as a team and matured as players. And uh, we started off with a young team. Nothing has changed, so we just won a game. The, the, there's still a hell of a lot of work ahead, and there's still a lot of th things that must that must improve. So definitely not getting it ourselves. Tomorrow, oh, next week, uh, Sunhul is going to be the biggest channel uh, challenge because everybody expects us to beat them. And that is even that's the most difficult games to go into. Mm -hmm. So. So we'll have to, um, first of all, put this win behind us, Use take the positives out of it, work hard on the negatives and keep on preparing ourselves to become better and better.